It's just, but it's still gonna be like, you know, like pretty much keep doing what you're doing, what you've been doing. So yeah, so man, like it's crazy cause everybody talks about like the fat kid experience. You know, everybody talks about like being fat and being obese, but nobody really talks about the skinny kid experience or like what it's like to be extra bony and shit. So I know for me, that's naturally like what I am. I'm naturally like super skinny. I look like Urkel until I was about 13 years old. Then I started lifting weights. <laughs> um, so when you want to think about being naturally skinny or naturally lean or naturally thin, whatever word you want to use, I want to insult nobody. When you think about that, you got to think about not only working out, but what kind of workouts you're doing and then how you eating. So for me, being that I'm naturally lean, my metabolism super fast and how I'm built, I naturally don't walk around super hungry all day. So I have to educate myself on maybe what supplements I need to be uh, using um, in a safe manner and how I need to be eating for my body type to uh, not only put on muscle and shock my system, but then to maintain it. Cause I gotta remember that naturally, I wanna cut it off. You know, I'm built to just lose it all if I start fucking up. So I gotta be thinking about those things too. Um, so remember, if you are naturally thin, picking up heavy shit is beautiful. But remember, your body doesn't respond that way. So volume training, will probably be your better friend because um, they're both good. So the heavy, um, low reps, low sets, mid sets, um, and also high sets, high reps, or mid sets, high reps, but high repetitions to push more blood into the muscle because you're gonna need a certain type of consistent time over tension or trauma on your muscle because you're not gonna have high reactivity as far as like your muscle fibers because of how you're built. And then also making sure that your ass is eating. Um, and it's real hard because with this body type, you're not naturally hungry. Like, you know, you may or may not have a sweet tooth, but you don't just walk around starving like that. So you could easily miss meals. You could easily miss hydration. You could easily miss out on things that help your body recover. Because remember, we build muscle, we build size. We get our gains and progress outside of the gym through rest and recovery. You can pick up as much weights as you want. You can lift as much as you want. If you're not properly recovering, it's all gonna go to waste. So all my naturally thin people, lean people, get in the gym, pick up heavy shit, pick up heavy shit a lot, all right? You don't get to do two or three power cleans and call it a day. You're not a mesomorph, you ain't built like that. And you're not walking around swole. So you gotta put a little more blood in there to make sure the shit stays, you know? And make sure you're eating, all right? Eat all the fucking time. But eat good though. Don't eat bullshit. Eat good. All right? Peace.